Take a look at these slabs of fish here guys. Can you guess which is which? All very different in texture and color. This is the triple tail. This is the almacoja and this is a piece of blackfin tuna. So we're going to be cooking all of them. See which one tastes the best. I have my preferred favorite from before but you never know. Things could change. What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Coast M Fishing. Today we're in the kitchen, somewhat unexpectedly. Um, but I'm doing this video for you guys. After the last race trip, I got quite a few comments saying to a catch and cook. Now I missed out the clean part because after you finish from your rigs fishing guys, to go on recording and cleaning that fish up until 9 o'clock in the night, it's be kind of hard, it's be tiring. But I'm still going to try and get the cook part done. I'm going to do that a little different too. So how I'm going to do it, I have three different fish we're going to cook today. I have some fillets of three different kinds of fish. Check it out right here. Comment below right now and make a guess which is what kind of fish. What is this? What is this? And what is this? Okay, 10 seconds to comment below. Alright, so the three fish on the plate. One is the triple tail. Two is the almaco jack. And three is the blackfin tuna. I don't know if you saw we call that. Joe Jalo caught it. We called one a small one, but that fish is great to eat, so I kept it. Now I have three fillets here. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna season them very slightly. Just some salt and black pepper, and we're gonna cook them in some olive oil. And that's it. And we're gonna do the taste test. I'm gonna taste it. Hopefully, I get my wife to come and taste it as well. And we'll compare notes and see which one tastes the best. You're gonna get any natural flavors of the fish because it's just salt and black pepper. Before we get to cooking, let's gonna go a quick recap on how we caught these, these three fish. So while I prepare everything, check out the footage. Triple tail, almond jack, black fin tuna. Check me back afterwards in the kitchen. Take it, of course. Take the line away. Yes, bring him, bring him, bring him, bring him. Bring him. Yes, got one. Got one. Drag and run, boy. Not 40 feet, boy. Are you wet? 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 Are you Alright guys, so we're back here. Now all I'm gonna season this fish with right now initially is salt and black pepper. That's it. So we have some JGM black pepper, of course. Only brand that I use. It's so gonna do a light sprinkling. We're gonna do both sides, fish up fillet as best as I could. I'm gonna throw some salt in there. Like I said, the point is to get the natural flavor of the fish initially. Then we're gonna spice it up a little bit. Alright, we'll do both sides. Alright guys, very lightly seasoned, salt and black pepper. That's it. I'm gonna put some olive oil in the pan. Great brand of olive oil, guys. Check it out. Great is best. She hungry, she hungry, she looking. This <laughs> tongue is too long. No, that's good. Here we go. This one is all getting out of trouble. Here. Guys. <laughs> so we're gonna be cooking the three types three. of fish. The three types of fish together at the same time. 
Now some cook faster than others, like the black fin tuna, that should cook faster than the other two. So I'll put that one last and watch it closely. You tell me which one is it? No. I'm not telling you anything. You have to give your opinion and see which one you take. You don't even know what kind of fish is this, actually. Yeah, actually. Was this my... Then you eat it out. <laughs> Alright, so the first one we're going with... Is this. I'll put it in text where it is. I have two pieces of this because that thick fish. So I have to slice the filet in half. Oh my god, they all sound different colors. Yeah, I do want like very different colors. Wow. What a big boy, I have in half. Knife please, assistant. Knife please. I wish I had an assistant in my pocket in this guy. She doesn't need one, she's super. I like splash it up. All the fish in the pan. <laughs> like I said, the black fin tuna should cook pretty quick. Why is it sticking, man? I don't know what fish is this. Then she sees that lie, she doesn't know which fish is fish. Which is what's going on. Fast, too much of the cook, I don't know. Alright, so first fish is coming off. Can I help you? Just like that, the fish is done, guys. So this is it cooked here, guys. It looks a little bit different now. I can still tell the difference. This guy kind of mash up a little bit. But the others, like I said, just salt and black pepper. And while it cool now, a little bit before we taste it, we're going to make a little sauce to top it off on it. The sauce is basically butter, lime and garlic. And that's it. Be delicious. Trust me. No COVID-19 one for her. Alright, so for the sauce, just a nice healthy piece of butter. In the same pan we didn't have a little oil remaining. I just want to put back on the stove. Melt the butter. We're melting the butter. The butter. Grating the garlic. Plenty garlic. Okay, this is this fish right now. Yeah, go on, taste it. Go on, taste it. Chill out, chill out. So, three cloves of garlic. It's a nice garlic sauce. Garlic, butter. Wow, that's a lot of juice. Break some. 
Ja, das hätte ich vergessen. Das ist auch super. Das ist auch super. Das ist auch super. Sauce is done. It's okay. All right, so now we're gonna taste the three fish before we put the sauce on it. So we start off with the white, white one. I'll put in the envelope where it is. I'm to guess the name or no? No, it's Spain. No, it's Spain. Yeah, just tell me how it tastes. Iran, never. Just like egg. Yeah, yeah. Screw All right, the texture is very soft and flaky. It tastes, I guess, like eggs, you say. <laughs> no, it tastes like chocolate egg. I like? No. It's soft. Soft, flaky, very soft, very flaky. Very soft. Not fishy. Now we're going to taste the next one. A lot fuller. This one looking like I don't like it a lot more. I like this one. The texture very this one cool. is a lot better. Mm -hmm. Not fishy um, again at all. Sweet, sweet, like sweeter. Sweeter, right? Remember, keep on, you gotta wrap them, right? I'll taste this last one here. Normally, I'll cook this one a little less. So that means it's a tuna. <laughs> that one's still my favorite. You flavor that fish by itself? Yeah. It's great. It's fishy, though. It's a little fishy, but I'm actually tasted. The other two kind of blandish. I feel. Alright, Rankin. First, second, third, what's your favorite? This one. Second, what's your favorite? No, then the first one, favorite one. Right. Then I would say this one, then this one. Alright, well, I mind this first black and tuna, then the alcohol, then the triple tail. That's the third one, we should have it. Black tuna. and tuna. Mm -hmm. Black and tuna, alcohol jack, and triple tail. This one is nice. A lot of people don't know, but Amoko is actually a, a sushi grade fish, um, so it's quite quite delicious. And we're gonna try and get some of this delicious sauce on it. We put it one time with this. I like this one a lot. Yeah, I like Amoko. Yeah. All right. So Maybe now, the fishiness in this one that I like. Yeah, for me, I like the taste of black itself, so that's why it's my favorite. Now we can try it with the sauce. Eat this. Mm. Mm. But now the sauce is trapped in it. Yeah, so if the sauce is in another dough. Yeah. Mm. I like those fish, I like it. Cool, Everything man. over here. To me, I still prefer the blackfin tuna as my favorite. But the three different fish we call out in trip. We also call rainbow runners and carangas. Carangas actually taste real good, but to, keep, to make it taste good, fillet them, cut out the bloodline, similar to these, and a quick cook up with that extra seasoning. The carangas taste pretty good. Rainbow runner I haven't eaten as yet, so I'm still did I have some in the freezer, but it would be too much to cook all of them. But in terms of these fish, blackfin tuna, great, um, great triple tail, flakiness, a little softer, not fishy at all, the whitest meat, so all of them taste pretty good. Um, the next extra sauce, can't go wrong. So I mean, have a tie? Yeah, sure. Which I mean, one? it's a tie with these too. But yeah, I'm black for me. Yeah, because I want to taste it though. I tell you what, why I didn't choose this one initially because of the fishiness. Fish, right. With lime and stuff. Yeah. Change the love I think I like these too. Right, so especially black pen and alcohol. Like, people do understand how good the alcohol tastes, and the texture is fantastic. And the one I cooked, this one is not one of the huge ones. This one is about five or six pounds, thereabouts. And it tastes pretty good. So what's this one? Triple D. Where is you eat after it again? Like how is it up? Like it always filet or like slices? Yeah, normally you should filet it. Or some people just bake it. But as, as you can see, it's a very delicate fish. This one was the one I caught. Um, we are two pounder. What? You know, it still tastes good, but I don't like the texture that much of it. Look at it. Whoa. Layers like in it. Yeah. This is like a mm -hmm. real nice fish. It is. So if you guys didn't work, so when I say one tastes like egg. So hope you guys enjoyed this <laughs> catch and cook. Still try to do it for you guys, even though it was a little bit late after thought. But I think it came out pretty good. Try three different kind of fish. 
and you know all of them tasted good but we definitely have a winner black pin tuna for me and then alma bajak also great same for you yeah thai all right cool team simple thing you can put the salt and black pepper and then make your sauce after go maybe yeah i didn't even need much more other stuff so thanks a lot for watching guys hope i was good company she was the mind she say my trip with this is like egg, but that is okay. I meant you know why? Like the texture, like it felt like egg. Kind of soft, like you know, yeah, yeah like when you yeah, make it nice egg. Yeah, like that was a spongy. compliment, by the way, because he's make egg nice, right? So it was a compliment. But like if it like that, that kind of will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I understand. Check it out. Food from you see, can't go wrong. So guys, thanks for also watching. Till the next episode. I don't know what kind of fish it'll be, but. I was fishing, <laughs> aquarium fishing. I think we can still go on the boat, so hopefully I can get to go on the boat a couple of times. But thanks a lot for watching, guys. Till the next one. Keep fishing. Cook on. Fish, Fish on. on. You have to clean stone now. Alright. Don't say which is which. Thank you.